AP and lateral x-ray of our next patient who has an L4-5 spondylolisthesis and L5-S1 degenerative disc disease with angular hypomobility. You can really see that on the flexed and extension views. And on MRI, there is a spondylolisthesis, degenerative disc disease, some lateral recess stenosis, and facet fluid signs. Therefore, we'll utilize a minimal invasive T-lift approach to perform a reconstruction at L4-5 and L5-S1. So we're back for two. Asymmetric collapse on my side. I have the antibody cage in. I have it nice and anterior. Now I'm going to expand it with this expanding driver. And it'll be like a car jack. It'll gradually rise up. And close. What are you doing now, Dr. Kim? Putting in the bone graft through this new bone graft inserter. Feeling good. How do you like using the navigation, Dr. Kim? It's like cheating, but you know what my mama always said? If you don't cheat every once in a while, you ain't trying hard enough. But look at that, it's going to be perfect. That's still 754. Huh? It's all 754, yeah. How'd the case go, Dr. Kim? It went very, very well. Your osteoporosis wasn't so bad that I needed to use cement, and the screws got very good purchase. And I think you're going to feel like an inch taller. I can't wait to show you the x-rays. So best wishes on a speedy recovery.